<laughs> Alright, speaking of John Numbers, John Numbers versus Jewel, and John gonna opt for the Mii Sword Fighter. I like this a lot, just because John will always go Sword Fighter on, like, those projectile heavy characters. That's why he goes Sword Fighter, sword fighter on me, just for the Ivysaur matchup. Like, he hates Inkling versus, like, those spammy characters, and Robin being one of those, following that same brand. Mm -hmm. but John I, was... Yeah. Sorry. Oh, no, go ahead. John was showing me a little thing he's uh, working on in terms of edge guarding, using Chakrams down in the ledge to, like, keep a hitbox out. Oh. I wonder if we'll see that. Yeah, uh, the Chakram does have two forms. It has the one where you shoot it out, and it, like, goes super far, and the one where, like, it comes back, and it co it's really good at covering ledge options, because yep. it just, like, lingers there, you know? And it's exactly, kind of exactly. Smash versus Boomerang Chakram. Yeah, exactly. Uh, right now, Jewel with a lead, and Robin at ledge is really good. John doesn't really know what to do there. What you have to do is you have to time your neutral get up or or a roll. It, but he has to read the roll. Yeah, but the timing is like you need a lot of Robin experience to learn the timing. Cause it's so particular. Yeah, it wasn't like that too much in Smash Four, if I recall correctly. Well, I mean, the issue was that Robin's stage presence was so bad in Smash Four, you were almost never in that situation anyway. Yeah, exactly. That's exactly it. Oh, that's oh. gonna be up B. That's the confirm. Yes. All right, man. That's like uh, that's imagine keeps, if that's the last time we see that, huh? That's what keeps this tonight, character out of bottom changes. tier, man. I think John's what keeps this character out of bottom tier. <laughs> but um, I do know last week, or the, the time Jewel won Zeno, he did beat John on his path, and this is a winners' quarters match. So we'll have to see if he can repeat what he did a few weeks ago. Right now it's looking pretty even. John back at ledge. That is just so good for Robin, man. Alright, nice tech chases by John. Oh, Robert. interesting interact. Oh, great stuff. That arc fire, meaning that he couldn't follow up on the uh, tornado. Yeah, it, and John likes doing that a lot, where, like, if he can't follow up on a confirm with, like, a second double jump from forward or whatever, he shock him. And that's what you don't want to do. I used to be, like, the king of doing that. You, He wants you to... Because he thinks you're, you're an F throw, right? And you usually DI in on F throw. But if you DI in on the down throw, it's a true up air. And, like, it's going to kill you that early. So what you want to do is usually buffer DI out. Was that a trump kill in Smash Ultimate? That was a trump. Damn. Jewel's showing us some good tech. And Jewel's always just been really good at the tech, man. You see him juggle the books and juggle, like, his sword. Oh, 24% off those two hits. Nice. Mmm. I'll tell you, man, that Levin Sword is just so bulky. Yeah. You know, the Levin Sword is so, like, well-known. Like, I hang out with, like, kids as part of my job. The yeah. kids all know what the Levin Sword is called. <laughs> That's sick. Yeah. Man, all these chakrams littering the place. It looks like La Mulana, you know? You play that game? <laughs> I haven't, but I, yeah. I do uh, have a friend who has played it. He showed me the game before. Yeah, well, the chakrams are in that game, and when they... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, that's not what he wants to be done. Uh, yeah, the air dodge being a lot laggier in this game, and not to mention, yeah. Sword Fighter doesn't have the best recovery. It's it also just clearly a misinput. Oh, yeah, of course. I mean, um, he wanted to go to ledge. And here's the thing. If Jewel has been paying attention to John's play on stream recently, yeah. he should be looking to bait those misinputs because yeah. John makes them a lot. Yeah. I'm not saying he makes them more often than other players because he's a great player who gets what he wants most of the time. But he definitely gets um, yeah, tilted it's, it's when those happen. It's easy to flub inputs when you're doing so many of them in this game. Trust me, like I'm a victim. I usually have tons of misinputs. All right. Ooh, Shadow Moses, definitely a John pick. He loves yeah, this he loves and he loves like Snake Eater the song as well. That's all, that's all we play on whenever we play sets. Man, uh, Robin looking like Wolf for a second there, just throwing out neutral base. <laughs> oh, she, he wishes. Let's get that. He's the using Man Robin. Okay. Was yeah. using Man Robin game one? Yeah, Jewel tends to alternate. Oh, that's a stock. That is your life, because that's what you, that's what you don't do on versus Robin. You, you never jump at ledge. But like we've been talking about, I don't know if John knows like too much about like Robin on ledge. Now let's see if John can play patiently enough to not be um, demoralized. Yeah, exactly. And I think John's issue right now, he's looking for these like reflects too much. He's doing it at the wrong times. He's kind of just guessing when Jules and throw out a projectile. Because every time I see him do a reflect, it just has not been working out. Yeah, yeah. He, he's just been kind of throwing him around. Yeah. Uh, so that's punish. There we go. All right, Jewel. Nice. Jewel knows now. Ooh. And I can't help but notice. Did Jewel get a new sponsor? Say again. Is Jewel sponsored by uh, Third Degree Gaming now? Or Maybe. Whatever? Oh, exciting. Alright, that's awesome. Alright, Devin with the head nod. Oh, that's actually pretty awesome. He's been doing really well. He definitely earned it. Ooh, that was interesting. Using it like cape instead of a reflector. Yeah, exactly. I'm not sure that was the true intention. See, there was an opportunity yeah, to reflect. Perfect opportunity, yeah. 
granted, he did what most people would do, wouldn't do and jump. Most people like try to spot dodge or shield, and that gives you like a, a, a yeah, true Yeah, he can just get into your zone and grab you. That Speaking so of grabs, good, yeah. oh boy, we're gonna see a lot more platform gra command grabs with Joker. Oh my God, Jewel! If, if these, there, there's two things he's really good at: parrying and moving. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a stock. Yep. All right, all right, all right. John's only one stock down. Yeah. He's come back from mo worse than that. He's he come back from worse than that against me. Oh, yeah. John is a clutch king, man. Not to say that I'm good, but, like, I've, <laughs> I've experienced John's clutch plays. Yeah, the point still lands, of course. John is clutch. Like, I, th I, th I feel like John would almost want to be down, then, like, winning. Ooh, upbeat, not going to be your stock, but that's still such good positioning. And Jewel at the ledge, Rama not being the best at disadvantage. Now, John going up B way high, he was probably worried about, like, um, what's Elwind, Elwind causing yeah. a spike or some shitty interaction. Wow, and Jewel's been two for two on those. That move was just so tilting to get hit by, man. That was a decent use of Reflect to adjust his... That's your stock. Yes. That character at ledge, man. Good, good grief. Uh, yare, yare, daze. I feel like what John had to do there, if he just timed the neutral get-ups, he would be fine. He, the thing is, I, I don't think he has the experience with those neutral get-up yeah. timings. I certainly do. What you, 